supine is uh, this is supine. Okay, this patient has unitric stone here. You will break it in supine position. You patient has a large upper uterine stone. You push inside. You may do RIRS. You may do PCN. For that, I have access from below, access from above. This is supine access. Your cystoscopy I can do. TORP I can do. Cystolithotripsy I can do. Suprapubic cystolithotripsy I can do. Uh, RIRS I can do. Supine PCN I can do. Laparoscopy I can do in one position. You don't want. It's okay. Then, supine are prone. You remember, is important that the rays comes from the below. You need know, it received by this. This is the primary thing. Rays come from below. So more you stand here, more rays will come to you. More you stand here. Supine PCN it will be like this. Prone PCN it will be like this. Little nearer. Every meter, every half meter, radiation gets diluted. If the rays are coming from, can you give two coins, uh, one rupee coins, or uh, any coin, say two, if you have. The stone C, big stone is seen there in the ureter. Can you see that? Huh? Yes. Upper ureter, it looks like. I don't know. But two coins, same size. Yes, very good. Who is that? No, they are not same. Same yeah, these two are same. If I keep the coin here, same coin, you do see them. This is the size, you turn that side. Keep it there. Keep it there, okay? Now same coin, I am putting on the back side, same position. Do it. What's happening? Yeah. That is looking big. So the stone which is nearer to the origin of the rays will get diversified more. That is one point. Now, if I put the same coin here, same coin here, see how, see how much difference. So manipulating below and uh, above one is missing. Now, both are in the same direction. Somebody enter into the room. You have seen this. First of all, are there are two, sto two stones or one stone? You don't know. This is supine position. Now, in between stone is there. That is also not seen. If you turn this to up, the image on the anterior side will go down in the down in the screen screen down in the screen whereas the stone which is present posteriorly will go up in the screen now one one degree you separate one one degree that's all already separated <coughs> so I, other one degree i have separated to up already what happened something they have gone the uh, the uh, bigger one is going, we, we don't know what will happen. Turn more, see him. Bigger was in going, a uh, bigger one is there where? Posterior. So remember this in lifelong, over supine piece. Turn, yes, see him. This is only 15 degrees. Why they are getting separated? Why they are getting separated, very important point. Why they are getting separated with small movement? Because they are widely separated. So if you are very close, then you have to move this more. If they are very far, they will get separated. That means within short movement, if they are getting separated, that puncture will not go. Take it out and put more anteriorly. If they are going lit after 30 degrees also they are nearer, you adjust there itself. Mm -hmm. You are understanding my Understood. point, this is very important point. If the two radio opaque shadows, one is needle and the stone are getting separated within short <coughs> rotation of this thing, that means you are not at all in correct direction. If they are not so getting separated very long also, that means uh, the, you are close, you can manipulate. That is the second point. Third point, you move, move, 
everything is going see they are getting apart now what will happen opposite will happen if you go here what will happen why you have to remember this side is a nonsense now you come to center yes now in prone pcnl you all know that if it is turned towards me whatever goes towards the spine is more posterior mm. what will happen here exactly opposite, opposite because the front is up now posterior will go to towards away from the spine if you turn this oh. towards posterior is a large one or bigger smaller one large one yes. large one will go away from the spine turn 5 5 degrees see am already moved away mm. 100% turn already moved away mm. 100% turn already moved away 100% that's all so if it is up mm. and down it is posteriorly located stone or anything radio opaque shadow will move up in the screen supine pcnl <coughs> whereas if you turn towards me posteriorly located uh, one will go away from the spine so posterior will go up in the screen if you turn up posterior will go away from the spine <coughs> if the it is turned towards me what is other turning up on from this how does it make difference How many turns are there in this yam? Only two, because it's two-dimensional. Over, thus bar be karo, under bar be karo na. Do do kinds rakhlo, rakhlo, or check it and you need not try two, three times. You will remember it. No position. This is the everybody says that in supine PCL can you do PCNL? Yes. Why? Because. the rib which is there is here my goodness here if you give in this position 100% i can puncture but to have better comfort we rotate not mandatory even upper calyx you can do why it's a horizontal puncture supine pcnl puncture will not be like this or will not be like this it will come here either like this either like this or like this or like this or like this <laughs> Don't worry about the posterior axillary line. Worry only about this rib, and mark it properly. After that, if you wanted, ninety-nine percent of this will fall below this. If you wanted to see this anterior axillary line, this posterior axillary line, you keep it. You can see the axilla. This is the mid axillary line. If you want to draw from here to here, one person can draw like this. Other person can draw like this. What a nonsense! the new puncture here intestine will not come ha <laughs> huh? you draw like this oh nicely you puncture senior will come and puncture here you see the abdomen here you see the abdomen this is relatively fixed part all are important not only that now you put it horizontally as posteriorly as possible and draw a line like this it will go much below this that is safe so i have two points one is rib tip below one is posterior axillary line try to be in this region unlikely the colon will come this is all assumption why in prone pcnl you don't assume you are every god is giving everything whatever the tract comes there also assumption you will puncture exactly in this region if you turn the patient now when you are puncturing here you are say that are a bulge is there or colon can come colon ideally if you turn it will go away for that answer is ultrasound don't say that uh, bullshit ultrasound we are top class uh, Uh, CM surgeons, uh, 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 because you don't know how to puncture. Uh, nah, if you put ultrasound here, I can see liver, I can see spleen, I can see intestine. What is the problem? <coughs> you don't want to see. Suddenly, <coughs> retrorenal colon is there unexpectedly. You want to go through the prone pcnl so colon. Prone pcnl also, you can put the ultrasound and see. Don't argue just because you are good in one surgery. You don't argue with others. I am a prone surgeon. I am a supine pcnl surgeon. I am a RIS surgeon. In that second case, will you do PCNL? No. No. So now, if you want to be little more comfortable on the surface here, you can turn. So people say under positions, under these things. What is the wrong if you are doing it? If you wanted to do more RIS, more legs separate. If you want to do more PCNL, less legs you separate. You decide what you want. No. This turn now he is alone there. He is not very hefty person. Yeah, I am alone there. 
Yes, I will do it, man. Where are you Turn. Turn. You don't do it, man. Turn. 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 I kept one here. I kept one here. Put the position. Now it is a little better area, na? Yes, sir. And you will put uh, one position here. Chuda ada and good no. Uh, then exaggerated uh, a little bit of. So how much time it took? Thirty seconds. Okay, I don't defend that thirty seconds versus five minutes in prone. Comfort, na? No, are you not comfortable yes. in this position? Uh, uh, are you feeling? ये पकड़ो नेक पर ना तो ना ये स्लीपिंग लाइक दैट इन द बेड लाइक लाइक दिस वी स्लीप ऑलवेज तो न्यूट्रल पोजीशन सो यू डू क्यू आर पी यू डू सिस्टोस्कोपी यू डू सिस्टोलिजोट्रिप्सी यू डू एवरीथिंग लैप इफ द बिग स्टोर इज देयर यू आर नॉट एबल टू रीच यू आर नॉट एबल टू लैपरोस्कोपी आई विल पुट एंड फिनिश स्टफ नो चेंज इन पोजीशन दिस व्हाट यूनिवर्सल पोजीशन फॉर एंडोवायरोलॉजी डू यू वांट टू एडज ऑफ द टेबल ओके इफ इट इज बेटर ना लिटिल बिट ऑफ मैनिपुलेशन कैन बी डन थोड़ा लेके आओ अगर नहीं लेके आए तो भी मेरे को फर्क नहीं पड़ेगा आई विल नॉट हैव एनी प्रॉब्लम थोड़ा एड कर फॉर दिस एड यू नीड टू पीपल अगेन दे विल आर्ग्यू अरे आप तो टू पीपल को ले रहे हैं फिर मेरे को बोल रहा है प्रोन को यू शुड नॉट आर्ग्यू लाइक एडवांटेज इज यू कैन एक्सेस फ्रॉम बिलो यू कैन फॉर एग्जाम्पल थ्री स्टोन आर देर वन स्टोन अबो वन सेंटीमीटर वन स्टोन बिलो वन सेंटीमीटर पेलिविक स्टोन थ्री सेंटीमीटर दीज टू आर वाइडली सेपरेटेड आर आई आर एस पर्सन विल गिव इन टू मिनट दिस थिंग टू यू Take them out now. There is no need for second puncture. That is called ECIRS. If suddenly, if a stone is there here, I am coming from below. Suddenly, stone goes into the upper kelly, very high in the subcostal region. What will you do? RIRS person ko bolo, or basket se or leke aake pelvis me rakho. Which or puncture I want, I will do and take it out. Puncture is my choice. Puncture is my choice. No need to puncture inferior calyx. No need to puncture middle calyx. No need to puncture upper calyx. I will puncture middle calyx. Take it out if I cannot. People say two surgeons, two monitor. You have hospital. That's why you are talking like that. In future, you will have four urologists not working anything. You have to make team only. They will come and they are ready. Arey arey, mere ko karne do paisa mat do. I will do it. <laughs> this situation may come. It's a team work. What is wrong? Do better to the patient. Why do puncture supra? They say that pleura me kya hota hai? Arey kya dal do? You put uh, one chest tube. There is no problem. You can put uh, even half uh, lung also. You can remove. There is no problem. Patient will die or what? Nothing. They will not die. You put uh, open surgery. You do anything. Even hematoma in in uh, kidney, peri lung. What will happen? Tumor thoracic. It will also dissolve. If it is possible, you do middle calyxial puncture. If you possible lower calyxial puncture, ideal puncture. So never should be biased with one procedure. Prone is good if it is supracostal puncture, vertically down where stagorn is there. You can deal very nicely with supracostal prone PCN. I like it because you look down entire surgery and all calyces can be inspected. There you cannot defend with the supine. Position is when you go inside. If you wanted to go extreme, this may come. If you want to go this side, it may come obscure. That is the problem. You should be flexible. If you want to access the urinary carifice, will go more lateral and superior. So you have to go like this. Once the access sheath is put, you have a road. Rail start from here, go to Kolkata. <laughs> so you pass the flexible scope, it will go to Kolkata. After that, you stand here, you stand here, you stand here, wherever, no problem. But during the insertion time, I will show. So in this case. Stented two urethric stones. I don't know where they are. I have to do urethroscopy. I have to push both these stones. Pushing both these stones is tricky. Small stone, if it is there, I will finish there only. Large stone, I will push for demonstration purpose. After that, I will put the flexible scope inside the kidney. Inject contrast whichever calyx. I will puncture there. I will dilate and remove it. If I cannot do that, I will finish in five minutes. Before. That facility is also there if you are a very good surgeon on both sides. I can do up to two centimeters. Patient wants PCN, I'll try it. If it's not at all happening, give an option of RIRS. For RIRS, only limitation is ureteric lumen should be adequate. For PCN, only limitation is expertise of the surgeon. However, you do can bleed on that. One side sepsis, another side bleeding. Both are dangerous. Bleeding problem is uh, advantage is you can give blood any amount. Sepsis uh, 
one or two antibiotics are only there. After that, you have to kill. But all sepsis patients will not die. All bleeding patients uh, may not get away with the uh, get away with the blood transfusion. So, never argue blindly for the sake of uh, argument. Understand both things carefully.